Hello! If you need to configure a proxy in Telegram, then this video is for you. I will show you how to set up a proxy for Telegram, which is installed on Android, EOS and Windows. From the beginning, let's set up a proxy in the Telegram, which is installed on the Windows. So, once you have opened Telegram, click on the menu in the upper left corner. Next, select Settings. In the window that opens, you need to select Advanced Settings. Find Advanced tab. Click on Connection Type. It is currently selected by default. The proxy settings open. The proxy is disabled by default. As you can see, I have disabled proxy selected, which means I don't use it. Choose the lowest item. Use custom proxy. Looking ahead, if you need to disable the proxy in the future, then you need to choose these settings, select disable proxy option. In that way, you will turn off the proxy in Telegram, which we will set up now. Now let's return to the proxy settings. I have already select use custom proxy and now menu has opened where we can set up a proxy. There are three protocols to choose SOX5, HTTP, MT Proto. You need to select the SOX protocol. Choose it. Next, in the socket address field, you need to specify the IP and port of your proxy server. Below, in the field credentials, login and password. But this is optional. When everything is entered, click on saved button. When you have entered and saved everything, this box closes and returns you to the previous one, where you can see the proxy you configured and its status. Everything is ready. And now let's set up a proxy for Telegram on Android. Open Telegram on your smartphone and go to the menu in the upper left corner. Here you also need to select settings. In the menu that opens, select data and storage. If on the PC the proxy settings is at the very top, then in the application on the smartphone, on the contrary, it is at the very bottom. Scroll down to the proxy settings tab. In the window that opens, select add proxy. As you can see, use proxy is not active at the top, because I don't have a proxy configured and not using a proxy on my smartphone right now. But after setting a proxy, this option will become active. Next, if you need to disable the proxy on your smartphone, switch it from active to inactive. And this is how to disable proxy. Let's proceed proxy settings on the smartphone. After you click on Add Proxy, a new menu opens. Select SUX5 protocol. In the Server and Port fields, enter your proxy IP address and port. Below, optionally, you can enter a username and password. When everything is entered, click on the check mark in the upper right corner. Automatically, you will be redirected to the previous menu, where you can see the proxy you entered and its status. Setup is complete. Now let's set up a proxy for Telegram on iOS. Go to the Telegram application. Select Settings. Next, go to the Data and Storage tab. Scroll to the very bottom. As on Android, the proxy settings on iOS are at the very bottom. Open Proxy. Here, as you can see, Use Proxy is also inactive. You can either enable Use Proxy or select Add Proxy. In the both ways, you will go to the proxy server settings. In the future, to disable the proxy, simply move Use Proxy from active to inactive. So, in the window that opens, we also select the SOX5 protocol. In the Server and Port field, enter the IP and port of the proxy server. You can set your username and password below. When everything is entered, click Finish in the upper right corner. That's all. Also, do not forget that you can buy high-quality proxies for Telegram on the Proxies.io. Our technical support will answer any questions and select a proxy for your tasks. Subscribe to the channel and click Like. Bye!